Love Gone Wrong Survival Guide. Survival Tip 2 is coming your way, and that is love yourself. And when I say love yourself, I don't mean the <laughs> sort of love, or when people walk up to you, they say, I love you, and you say, look, we've got that in common, I love me too. Not that sort of love, that's too much. Just be kind to yourself, care about yourself, and look after yourself going forward. And if you do that, then you'll be able to love someone else and bring them into your life. Because as you're trucking down the whole line of love, just keep trucking out to the sea. You're probably at a point where someone's turned off. That's why you're here for the love gone wrong. And they've turned off behind you. Now, there's three major turn-off towns here. The first one is you don't listen, big no-no. <sighs> Heavily booked out, that one. Number two is you only think about yourself. Quite common. Book ahead in advance to get into that one. But the big one is the I don't love you anymore. They're on the queuing ramp to get into that town. They're banked up miles down the road. As you keep trucking forward, people fall off. But you just gotta keep going forward. You get a little bit tired, pull over and have a rest. Get out and tap the tires as the truckies do. I don't know why, but they do, okay? And look after yourself, right? And remember, you're not alone at this point. You're not alone. There's lots of agencies out there to help you go forward, like one, Beer, wine and spirits, great to help you go forward. Uh, there's food, takeaway food outlets. Uh, there's religious groups. Um, there's tarot readers, clairvoyants, star sign guide people to give you a bigger and a better, brighter future. And there's, of course, uh, the one that was there at your birth and will be with you all of your life. No, not mum and dad, but the taxation department. They're there to guide you and help you go forward. They'll always drop in, okay? So you're not alone at this point. So maybe you wanna just slow down and have a look at yourself in the mirror. If you can risk it. Just look at what other people have to see every day. Look in the mirror and if you don't like what you see, you can do what I do, just buy a new mirror. Maybe not, maybe not. Maybe you can work on being your better self. And maybe learn to uh, sit with yourself. Stop the chatter. You know the chatter? Can we stop the chatter? You know that noise? And just sit with yourself and like meditate. Like you do at a traffic intersection all the time. When you're caught in traffic, just meditate, relax. Like, you know, slow down. One, two, three, four. <gasps> That's long enough. Must be something on Netflix. I've got to check the phone. <laughs> Maybe a little bit bit longer than that. And, and these things will help you go forward. So how do you learn to love yourself or like yourself or care for yourself? One, diet's always good. Three meals a day and stop the snacking. You can have that as well, but, but, eat, but eat well. Vegetables, uh, meat, eat good quality food. Uh, That's always the takeaway. And a martini with an olive in it, in it isn't, isn't a salad. Six or seven stubbies don't equate to a good steak. Okay, so look after what you eat. Spoil yourself. Have a facial. Uh, cut your hair. Have a shave. Have a massage. Uh, go out. Get a new wardrobe. Buy new clothes. Uh, or if you haven't got much money, go to the second-hand opportunity. There's some great stuff. They're just freshen yourself up. Get into a fitness regime. Just go for a walk or a jog. Um, if you've got a bike, ride it. There's plenty left on nature strips. Just grab one. Move around. Just keep moving, okay? Walking's great. Uh, you don't need to carry weights. You're carrying enough as it is because you just come out of a relationship, okay? Um, there's other things you can do. There's hobbies and interests. Uh, sports uh, are good. Music, arts. Um, there's meetup groups. Go online. Uh, get out there and date. Love does not come up and tap on the door. Unless, of course, it's a delivery driver and you're really lucky and they look great. You might do that, okay? And if you're really struggling, because some people are and you haven't got much money, walking around the unit or the block is not going to take a lot. Uh, there's council and government agencies that can financially help you to go forward. And there's always your parents, your in-laws, your neighbours. There's always kind-hearted people out there that will help you get by. So remember... As you're trucking down the highway of love, learn to love yourself or care for yourself or respect yourself. And in that way, you will learn to love other people as well. Keep on trucking. Love yourself. I do.